All right, hey guys, OFD checking in here, and today we have a beautiful Tudor Black Bay Steel for sale at CW Watch Shop. Guys, if you're interested in this watch or another luxury watch in your life, check out the link down below to CW Watch Shop. All right, guys, today we have the Tudor Black Bay Steel reference number on this is the 79730-004. This watch does come on the Tudor cloth strap. Very nice watch. It comes with box and paperwork. It is double boxed here. You do have the paperwork inside of there as far as the um, guarantee paperwork and the instruction manual. I did not see any warranty cards or anything like that, but you also get the outer sleeve for the box. So nice piece. This is a modern Black Bay, as you guys can tell. This is running the new MT5612 movement in here. So you're getting a, a certified chronometer watch. These are CSOC uh, certified. They do get date functionality with that movement also, and you get 70 hours of power reserve. So this is quite an upgrade from the ETA-based Black Bay uh, watches out there. Talking specifications on this watch, guys, you obviously have a 41 millimeter case from side to side, very traditional in that Black Bay series. Just over 50 millimeters lug tip to lug tip. I measure slightly over 14 millimeters from the back of the case to the top of the sapphire crystal, and these watches employ 22 millimeter lug openings. Beautiful, beautiful dial on this watch, the black dial. They call it the steel because of the, the, the steel on the bezel insert here. You guys can see your applied indices all the way around, 18 karat gold as well as your snowflake hands on the watch, but beautifully done. I love that touch of red on the 200 meters or the 660 feet down here at the six o'clock position. Very, very nice watches. One of my favorite things about Black Bay watches, and I really don't think it can be beat, is the bezel action. They are clean 60 click bezels on these watches. And I mean, they just have a very crisp, crisp functionality. Every Black Bay that I've ever had on the channel that I've owned myself, I've owned uh, two different Black Bays. Actually, I've owned three. I own the Black Bay GMT. I own the Black Bay Red with the ETA. And I also owned, excuse me, at one time, the Black Bay Black um, with the ETA movement. One of the biggest differences between these and the AT ETA versions, obviously, you're getting an in-house movement, 70 hours of power reserve, um, and a date functionality, but the thickness of the watch. These are, you sacrifice some thickness by about two millimeters on these watches. They're about two millimeters thicker. Cloth, Tudor strap on this watch appears to be in pretty good shape. I did, I do believe that this reference number originally comes on a, uh, a green factory um, cloth strap, but uh, this black one seems to be have been swapped out for it. So the watch is in really good shape, a little bit of marks down here for where, from where people have done strap changes. But other than that, the watch is really, really clean. Nice chamfer still there visibly, so you can tell no one's really polished it. Show you this side here with the signed crown. Sorry for that, guys. We're getting a lot of reflections off of this one. You do also get the, um, it has the anodized aluminum sleeve here. I think it's an anodized aluminum, but here, as you guys can see, really looks neat the way it, uh, you know, mates up to the case like that. Very nice looking timepiece. Like I said, this one is available at CW Watch Shop. Very good pricing on this one. Let's go ahead and pause it for a second, get this watch on my 7-inch wrist, and then stick around for that loom shot. All right, well, the Tudor Black Bay on my 7-inch wrist is something that I really love. It is a thicker one with these new MT5612 movements in it, but it's a great, great-looking watch. Honestly, if I didn't have other things going in my life and buying some other toys, I'd probably be really interested in picking this one up myself, but not going to happen on this one. But guys, go check it out if you're interested. This is an absolutely stunning and beautiful piece. Let's dim the lights and check out the loom. All right, guys, we'll charge it up and check out the loom, but we only have seconds because one of my neighbors just started, decided to start running a tile cutter next door, and it's loud. It's really loud, so hopefully you guys can't hear it, but we'll go ahead and loom the watch up here. As you guys can see, really nice loom pip on that watch and bright loom on the hands. The Tudor Black Bays that I've owned in the past have honestly been some of the brightest loomed watches that I've ever owned, and this loom lasts throughout the night. Looks really, really good. So, guys, if you're interested in this watch, check out the link down below to CW Watch Shop. I'll leave a link where you can get on over to their site and check out what they have to offer. So, guys, like the video, give me a thumbs up down there at the bottom, and if you've not subscribed to the OFD channel yet, please do. Please do. Thanks, guys.